Hi boys and girls, welcome to learning time. I've got a very special piece of equipment today. I want you to look over here and I've got a lot of friends over here. We're going to look at this piece of equipment. This piece of equipment is called a Newtonian cradle. Some people have these on their desktops. Have you ever seen that? They've got five little steel balls. You take one of them and you drop it into the others and something exciting happens. Now, this is one of the very special laws of science. Now, I've got a helper over here, and let's see what we can do with this one here. Now, Lauren is going to help us with this, and I want you to take one of these balls over here. Can you grab one of those balls for us? And why don't you drag that back for us, and what do you suppose is going to happen when he drops it or releases it? What do you think is going to happen? Well, let's find out. We've got one, and what happens on the other side? That's right. If we get one in, then one goes out. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. This is what this teaches us today. Now, hey, let's try two of those balls. Now, Tori's going to help us with that. Tori's going to grab a hold of this orange ball, and we're going to find out when we have two balls coming in. I'm wondering how many balls do you think... Would you have guessed that? Two going in, and two goes out. Well, this is going to be interesting because we have more than just two balls. I'm going to take this ball right here. Now we're going to put three of those balls, and we're going to make all three of those balls come in. But there's a little bit of a problem. Do we have three balls over here? No. Oh, no. I'm wondering what's going to happen. Okay, let's pull this back, and let's let it go, and... Whoa! Whoa. Did you see that? If three go in, how many have to go out? Three. Hey, let's stop these balls. Let's see what happens if we use four. All right, I'm going to take this green ball. I'm going to move this back like this, and let's let this thing go, and four in and four out. Hey, that's exciting. Now, I'm going to see what's going to happen next. Let's go ahead and stop these balls. How many balls do we have? Five. Well, if I put all five of those out, I wonder how many will go the other way. Five. Well, let's find out. Here we go. Watch this. This is really cool. Let's put five in, and what comes out the other side? Five. Well, five. You know, that teaches us something very special. For every action, there's an equal and opposite reaction. You know, that works with our lives, too. If we put junk into our lives, you know what we're going to get out? That's right. We're going to get junk back out. So we've got to be careful what we put into our minds and our eyes because everything that goes in has to come out. And I want to guard all of my senses. And I'm glad that you're here today with us too. And I want you to remember, when we learn about science, we're learning about Christ, the Creator, God.